video. I'm about to go and Church's Chicken. Ooh, the sun. Hold on. For their smokehouse rotisserie chicken. Okay. I'm going to blame this one on Yummy Bites TV because we should have eaten something. It be looking good. So I'm going to let y'all know if it's good. Um, her husband said her, his was kind of dry. And when I saw some uh, baked looking chicken, it was looking kind of dry too. So let me see what it's giving. Okay. So I'm at this pretty cool Airbnb slash house that they're trying to sell deep in Conroe. She cute. That's the lady who's trying to sell it right there. Right there. Hey, Diane. <laughs> so she's uh, doing an open house, but it's nice out here. It's nice. It don't smell like roaches or nothing. She cute. Look at uh, the view. Look at that. Right off the water. Could you imagine living over there? That's nice. Mm-hmm. That's a little patio and stuff, child. Had me driving out here all around town. It was so bad I had to stop and get gas because GPS took me in a totally different direction than I had to twirl around, come back this out. Mm-hmm. People on a boast, child. What they do for a living. Mm-hmm. They living a life, child. These houses are nice. How much this house go for, Diane? $333,000. Okay, that's a drop in the bucket. <laughs> or you could rent it for $2,400 a month. You got it. I'm like, you pay all that money. You might as well just get a house if you can. That's oof. Ooh. So if it's $2,400 a month, their mortgage is probably about $1,200. about the real mortgage right I know about 15 mm -hmm. yeah about 1500 mm -hmm. that's what I think I know I was paying less when I had my house mm -mm, child. but you could rent it out for a month for 2200 that's cute like if you have a whole bunch of people and y'all want to rent it out where's your pitch my pitch yeah. I am pitch how you selling it <laughs> it's a beautiful house right on Lake Carmel you looked outside that's your pitch. That's my pitch. <laughs> Sells itself. <laughs> it's furnished. Well, maybe I'll just go ahead and get it, y'all. What y'all think? What y'all think? Mm -hmm. So I met Diane. This is Diane right there. Facing the sun. You did? 2007? Oh, you remember the date? That's when I moved here. See, that's where she she usually keeps me on track. <laughs> She was like, you know you have that appointment. How do you know? Just because I know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and so our kids went to the same daycare. How old were they? About six? Yeah. Were they in school already? In 2007, no. John was five and Samantha was seven. So he did pre-K that year. And mm -hmm. then Samantha was in first grade. So. So our kids met at daycare. Kids are kids. It was expensive, but they had a pretty good curriculum, though. They did. You you go there, your children coming out reading. That's what they doing, coming out reading. And you know, you have some friends. You don't have to see each other, talk to each other every day. But it's like you know they're there, like you know, in the universe somewhere. Are you picking up what I'm putting I down? Did. I am. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Even when we don't see each other for years, we're still there for each other. Like it was yesterday that we mm -hmm. saw each other. Mm -hmm. And her mother, she loved me. She loved she me. She did. And then one day I got stuck in Hollywood. And Diane was like, oh, my sister, my sister's there. You can stay with my sister. No, that was, I went to stay with her because I was going for the Disney team. Mm -hmm. MT, uh, what was it? 
the Disney Teen Movie Awards or like MTV that. Movie Awards. It was one of those when I had my company and I stayed with her sister, her, her, her family. They were amazing. They were just, they're just beautiful people. Beautiful people. Picked mm. you up from the airport who you never met. Spent like a week with them. And then the little girl, the girl who was staying there, she's yep. grown now. Yeah, yes. She's got kids now. <gasps> she does? She does. Adorable kids. Yes. Oh my goodness. And so do they still have a lot of uh, animals? They sure do. I think at least four or five cats. Mm -hmm. And about three or four dogs. Lord. Lord. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but they they're so sweet and I, I just loved her mom. Her mom was just just so sweet. Absolutely. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm gonna sit here and chit chat and catch up with Miss Donnie here, okay? And check out the rest of this house, okay? Mm-hmm. Just imagine the upkeep on this thing. She pretty dope. She nice. When you got that coin, honey. A lot of people out here with this the vacation home. visiting with my friend Diane and she's showing how this child so she had to run to another house so I just got to the hotel and was surprised by Bobby Bobby done cooked honey and she had asked me if I had eaten early I was like yes I did it was good no it I was told you not to eat but I had already had the food by the time you asked me that. And it was already 4.30. What you want me to do, bro? What? But you don't think I'm going to get hungry again? Yeah. So, let's see what she done made, child. Let's see this. Let's check this. Child. Child. What you done got here, Bobby? <laughs> Tell us what you made. Well, it's... Cajun pasta. So there's shrimp and sausage and onions. And it's like a Cajun Alfredo sauce. Ooh, and I love me Alfredo chow. Yeah, it's pretty much Alfredo with sausage and shrimp. And do you put a tomato or something in there? Mm -mm. No. Mm -hmm. No? Mm -hmm. Parmesan cheese? Mm hmm. She looks good. And usually I sprinkle some green stuff on the top of your Need some parsley. Well, it's been a minute since Bobby done cook, but it's nice coming home. And there's something to eat. <laughs> Go, Bobby. Go, Bobby. Go, Bobby. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm telling you, everybody needs a good hype, man. So Bobby done did the thing. She said she liked my outfit, y'all. She liked my outfit. See, she's giving. That's what she's giving, honey. She's giving, okay? 
and said, who, who said you can't play dress up? Why you can't? And you can? Why does every day have to be look, looking like you're drawing on a t-shirt and some sweatpants or your house pants and a bonnet? Nah, yeah. And um, so my friend Diane, she was like, and your hair is too long. She said, it needs to be about right here, right here. And I was like, that's, I, that may work for other people. But for me, I was like, no, that's just, that's just regular. That's just average, you know, that's the average. She was like, no, it drags your face down. I was like, and she said, you know, I'm going to tell you and you tell me. I said, I sure do. But, you know, that's her opinion. But, you know, I like it long. Go baby, go home. That's where I come from. That's the, that's the, that's how I feel. Okay. I get compliments on my hair every day. Every, every day. Okay, Diane. I appreciate your opinion, but I'm going to leave it alone. <laughs> all right y'all i can't wait to get into her dish i did just eat though for real but i want to try it well <laughs> but how long you been saying you're gonna make that what do you mean the pasta well you asked me earlier this week but i couldn't do it earlier this week so i was gonna make it the other day but then you went to olive garden and then so i just waited till today Okay. But I did say that I was going to make it. And mm -hmm. I mean, mm -hmm. you did. You did. She's giving, honey. She's giving. How's yours doing, Bobby? Good. Hmm? Good. Is it itch? No. Did you put yet. more cream? Mm -hmm. When I got out of the shower, I bought some more at the store. Did you use the card? But did it have an F next to it? Oh, but the vitamins and stuff? You gotta keep doing it. It does work. What? Okay, guys. Okay, guys. What's up, house babes? Your girl Joy back with another banger. So I just got back from my daughter's graduation party. So now I'm off to another party a birthday adult birthday party so i just have this on you know i'm thick now y'all bobby's home so i was able to get borrow my belt and then put my little heels on and i don't worry about my bathroom it's been a busy day it has been a busy day i'm here to slay baby i would never go to school like this uh-uh so let me see, they say it gets a little warm in there. So hopefully I won't be too hot. So I had on another little jacket thing and I took it off. I don't think I'm gonna wear a hat. I think that's pushing it. Sometimes I be feeling like a witch. <laughs> so I'm just gonna do like this. The hair needs to be redone, but that's okay. I'll take out two rows and just do my crown, honey and pretend like the whole thing is done. So, this is it. Yeah, I'm getting thick, thick, y'all. I'm getting thick, thick. <laughs> That's okay. I know how to work it out, honey. I know how to work it out. I just think I need to get through school. I'm just, I'm exhausted. I'm really exhausted. I really worked my tail off this year. So, with that said, I am going to slay. <laughs> 